Hi there, it is December 2nd and I'm on IntelliCast. Look at in Australia, we have the donut again. Look at that. Let's move over the little pointy thing just to see what the weather's like there right now. Hmm, it says it's clear. <clears throat> Let's make sure. Oops. So, if we just look at the clouds, you can see that it's basically clear. Radar and clouds. These, these dots are all earthquakes. Um, This one was at 1 o'clock GMT. The red ones are within the last six hours. Oh, now it's disappeared. Let's get rid of the earthquakes for the moment. And let's put this on. Here's the timestamp right here. Let's make it move. There it is for just a flash. And you can see the time right here when it shows up, 9.59, and then it's gone. Hmm. Isn't that interesting? Okay. Okay, here I am on Weather Zone, and um, these um, links will all be below. Here's the loop of uh, radar. And these little crosses all mean lightning, so there actually has been some storm activity going on around it. Um, let's see if I can make it move. And here's the timestamp here. There you see it. Hmm, isn't that intriguing? Okay, now if we go up here to this, Queensland, it will show us a bigger version of it. And it looks like by this tracking in here that there's chemtrails in there. But I'm not exactly sure what that is. Um, but see those lines in there? And I'm not exactly sure what that flashing radar is doing. But it looks like it's coming out of emerald, perhaps. Okay. But if we look over here, heat wave to scorch Queensland well into next week. So does this radar have anything to do with that heat wave? Hmm. What do you think? Now this is interesting and I see this a lot. This is El Dorado weather. Now that isn't even showing up, that donut on here. So here's the timestamp. There's nothing even showing up on that. In the Queensland. So weather or the radar none of that donut so this looks like a little donut over here but nothing right here isn't that interesting and that's the way it is when you look at the weather anywhere so all these different weather links will show you different stuff and then you kind of have to decipher and piece together what it is that's the truth Okay, this is still El Dorado weather. It's um, a different part of that. Um, <clears throat> this has got an interesting circle going on right here of temperature. <laughs> I mean, it's an exact circle, but let's look at some of the other things they offer that we can see here. Wind chill, which is really hot, so that's not very cold. Heat index. Wind. You see this almost perfect circle right here, and then the little one, and then these. That's odd to me. Pressure. Temperature is the already did. I know 
it is here. So, it doesn't tell you a lot, does it? I love this. This is just weather, but it's weather by Yahoo. <laughs> okay, so this shows the donut really clearly, along with the timestamp. And it looks a lot like another um, site that we are, have already seen. And there it is! Ta-da! Okay, here's another one very interesting. MLA Meat and Livestock Australia. Because, of course, the weather does affect the price of meat. Now, this is showing the donut. And then we go down here because it's, like, centered in this town of Emerald. We we'll click on Emerald. And look at that. It's all around this sucker. Boom! 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 Okay. Now what I meant look like chemtrails are these lines that you see here. These snaky lines that are in here. That looks like chemtrails to me. Okay. Australian Government Bureau of Meteorology. Emerald Radar Loop. And this is showing up as blue. Pretty, isn't it? And blue. Is showing up on this key. As far as rain. But... It's not raining in the whole area. <laughs> so what does that mean? I don't know. What do you think it means? Okay, so I went on this uh, tropical cyclone um, site. This is from Wisconsin Education. Uh, so then I go down here and I click, click on here, images and movies. Now it looks like right up here and right up here is a circular pattern of storms. Um, and the loop, we can watch it right like this. And it does appear that there's some kind of storm starting to develop, which if it's hot, you're going to want some rain. I can zoom in there, but you don't really see, there's no radar here. Just kind of see what's going on with other stuff, as far as infrared satellites. So my curiosity usually pushes me to look a little bit more. Well, here we go. Queensland severe sun thunderstorm warning. <laughs> oh, isn't that interesting with the donut and everything? All right. So um, I'm on this website called Elders. And what is Elders? And who would make money off of weather creating? Um, this is a financial um, site so they will help you rural services real estate businesses all the things they do finance training programs servicing Australians for more than 175 years elders grain and of course they're going to be interested in the weather and really farming is about weather but if you can make a profit, and if you can blame it on nature and still make a profit, whether it's successful or whether it fails, because you are dealing in business, then you're going to do what you can to make money if you're that kind of person. Right? Just a thought. Okay, here's Elders Indonesia. Now, what's some of the things that they're involved in here also? Pharmaceutical stuff. I don't know what this represents, and I can't click on it because it doesn't show up. 
but beef and some kind of ramectin. Hmm, what do you think about that? Okay, here's their product. Beef cattle, dairy cattle, dairy genetics, beef and beef byproducts, abattoir equipment, animal health products, services, processing, training, consulting, and then it's back. Uh, about us. La 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 la. Okay, so I'm back on the original website, and here is the elder stock, and it's up 0.1%. Not a lot, depending on how much money you have invested. Okay, now remember just a little bit ago, they were saying it was clear where we were at. Now, here's a warning for Queensland. Severe storm warning, destructive winds, heavy rain, and large hail for Darling downs and granite belt and southeast coast and this one is uh, severe storms to affect Mount Blarney, Rath Downey, between Buna and Blue Desert, Maroon Dam, Laurel, Val, Gurul Ben, I'm sorry, Lamakin, Lamaginton, I am so sorry for mispronouncing those but um, that's very interesting. So I'm looking at the radar on the elders page, and that donut isn't on here. Here it does look like a severe thunderstorm right in that area. Um, let's see if we can go back. There we go. There's the donut. Okay. So this link will also be below. It's right up here, too. By any chance you didn't get it. Um, yep. Yupper, yupper, yupper. Okay, now this website, Otter Walks, uh, talks about next rad harp um, at Emerald, Central Highland, Australia, IRI ring event. Um, in, back in August 2016, they were 36 hours into this ring event. There seems to be a pattern of impacts. And if you want to continue reading the link, right here will be below. Otter Walks WordPress. With a lot more information about um, these kind of things happening. And then, of course, a lot of other information. And some of these tags are very interesting, like synthetic plasma, ozone depletion, ionic spheric heaters, future weapons, frequency, covert operations, censorship, bioengineering, Raytheon, radiation, weather weapons, a lot of interesting stuff that you can find on this website. I would recommend it. Okay, so this is a video that's on this site, Weather Modification Exposed on Australian News on, oops, I'm sorry, weatherchange.org. Um, the link for this will be below, but here they talk about weather modification that happened right before a flood, and there's, people are upset, and they're thinking that it caused it to be worse. So I would um, encourage you to click on that link. And this is a Facebook page called Harp in Australia. And here is a picture of the same type of a donut. September 17th, last night at 11.10, posted by this person right here. 